will show how Armenians exist here and why are they here and who are they exactly. This Armenian Museum is just like a passport for the visitors who come here and see what it is about because it shows Armenians before even the genocide because people only think about the genocide and Armenians. No, we existed even be much before, even before Jesus Christ. The meaning of Armenians staying in this city is that uh, just like Jerusalem had been conquered from a lot of people a lot of years ago and also still uh, suffering and thriving, it doesn't have to be uh, who or what or when, but it's still going, going and on. Same thing with the Armenians. They had a lot of problems and troubles a long time ago and still are doing that, but both have the same uh, destiny, which is they will never give up and they will survive. Surviving is its meaning not to be seen. Nobody heard, nobody knows. Yeah, you heard about the Armenians. You don't know who are the Armenians. And that's the, that's the beauty in it. We survive without people knowing what or who we are. And today we feel ready to show you and to teach you about the history, about the heritage, about the culture, and to show you how we advance and survive and modernize with the time. It's for us, it's for our safety and preserving the language which is about 2,000 years, the heritage which is about 2,000 years. It's about the history ev eventually and preserving it because if you see news a bit, we're still prosecuted until today, unfortunately. And this is one of the small landmarks we have because eventually the most important places of Christianity is here. He's buried here, he's crucified here, he came to life here. So very eventually showing your power in the most important place in Christianity is Jerusalem. And you have a quarter in it, 